Well, we are at another beach on the Point Reyes National Seashore, and this is Drake's Beach, and normally they have a, a restaurant over here, right there. And, you know, I pull up, and there's uh, elephant seals all over the place. There was one right here popped his head out of the water. Um, but I can't get too close to them. They have uh, really strict rules. Basically, leave them alone, but I should be able to get close enough and film a little bit up. So this is Drake's Beach. So the rule is two car lengths. You need to stay two car lengths away from them. Um, I'm more than two car lengths. Who's waving? There's some big animals. And there was one, like I said, when I pulled up over in that lagoon there, and he's still there. So they must be able to hold their breath a long time. And as you can see here, I'm going to walk over to the sign there. It says beach closed. See the one there just chilling in the sun. And the one there. And they're funny. You see these marks here? They um, they kind of go like this on the sand. They get momentum and they go boom, 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 boom. And you can kind of see one way off in the distance doing that. They use their blubber and they get their blubber going. I think those two down there are fighting. They look like they're fighting. The males will fight over the females. But here's a track here. But this beach here is a lot calmer than the South Beach. The South Beach is facing the ocean, and this is the hook of Point Reyes. This is kind of like the bay. Even It's the ocean, but it's blocked by that big hook, so it's a lot more mellow. They just lay there. They don't do much more than just chill. Look at the seagulls there. They're like, did you bring any Doritos for me? I love Doritos. Is a sand dollar. Got a crack in it. So we're gonna walk down here a little farther and see what other wildlife we might be able to discover. Here's another sand dollar. almost perfect. Another one, there's a lot of sand dollars here. See that one there? And one over there. The key is to find one that's not cracked. There's one that's got a little, tiny little hole in it. That one looks pretty good. Aha, look at that. Uncracked sand dollar. I think I'm gonna take that and give it to my daughter. I wonder about sand crabs and here's what they look like. They're weird little things. You see this? They live under the sand, hence the name sand crabs. Another sand dollar. Wow, this is a sand dollar beach. Looks like they might have some really good tide pools over here too. Wow, what a perfect day for February. I, what's the day? I think it's the 9th today, 2020.
22. And this is why people live in California. The East Coast is getting slammed with snowstorms. And, and here we are in the 70s. And I'm on the beach. The beach is usually the first place to get cold. It's not cold. I got a t-shirt on. What a day. Those cliffs are cool. They kind of look like the Grand Canyon a little bit, but the color is wrong. This next group of rocks is, is very strange because it looks like a bone. Doesn't it look like a vertebrae of a dinosaur? Like the shape of these things and then the cracks. It's wild. Aha, now these might have things in them. You might see some sea creatures, sea snails. I don't see any. Uh, there's a sea enemy. Oh, these barnacles. Look what it did to my hands. These things are razor sharp. Wow. Okay, I found one. Watch. See this thing? Watch. It's alive. You see that? Isn't that wild? They move and just hanging out. Here's another one. Look at this one. Crazy, huh? And man, those barnacles, the edges are like razors. More of these crazy rocks. They look like, uh, they don't look like rocks. Pretty wild, huh? I think I'll walk down to that next grouping of rocks and that'll probably be it for me. I'm getting drawn over here because someone made a, a little like uh, wind shelter tree fort. Ooh, check this out. Another perfect sand dollar almost. Two of them. You see that? Another one. And another one. This one's not broken. They're way up here. And there's a little fort someone made. It's got a little bench in it. That's pretty cool. I like it. And these cliffs are a lot more uh, vertical and straight up than you think. Look at the sides of them. You can almost see like faces in them, in those rocks. Ah, here's a crab shell. That's pretty big. Em. Good sized crab shell there. Check this one out. Another crab. And I think it's other claws over here. Go. Look at that one. That's a good one. I'll be honest, I, I haven't been to a beach like this with sand dollars. I've seen a few, but this one's got tons of them. Tons of them. Crazy, huh? It's another one. And a lot of them are in good shape. 
That was cracked. Now I'm going to get picky. There's a perfect one. I think. It's got a little edge broken. i get picky again. Let's see. We want the perfect one. Aha. Two. There's a good one. And there's a good one. Look at that one. Pretty awesome, huh? This is like a gold mine for sand dollars. They're everywhere and they're in good shape. Look at that one. Crazy. Here's a real good one there. Getting distracted. There's a cave over here. And more sand dollar, sand dollar, sand dollar, sand dollar, sand dollar, sand dollar. Cave isn't cool. Doesn't go that far in. It's more of a crack. Stop collecting them because I already have a pocket full of these things. Damn. Now that I'm out here, I think there's probably hundreds, well, probably thousands of these things. Here's a whole swarm of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, look at the brown one up here. Look at the color of that guy. It's weird, it's like it's rust, but you know it's not. Pretty neat, I like that one. Kind to do a 360 here. And these birds are probably a good thing to follow. sounds harsh but if you guys like to get away and recharge with nature uh, look check this out there's like no one out here and there's sand dollars everywhere there's elephants see it look at that check that out I'm walking along and there's an elephant seal right there blend right in so here he is I'm being quiet so I don't wake him up you can kind of see why I didn't see him he looks like a log doesn't he tide has receded and I can walk out a little more and to sand dollar graveyard basically because these things are not alive anymore there's three uh, paddle surfers out there paddle board surfers Water's trying to get me. It's trying to get me. I was walking about 15 feet down there and all of a sudden it tried to get me. There's a uh, F-21 that just went by. You see it? Crazy. Just standing here and one of those things go by. 
Look at the sand, the pattern of the sand. It's like diamond shaped almost. There's a vulture cruising along. And here is another one. Yeah, another vulture. It comes out of the one right here. The big birds. Well, I'm heading back to the car or slash motorcycle. And there's another one, but he's uh, in deep sleep. He's dreaming of fish. So man, I wish I had some fish right now. You know, sometimes it might be nice to be an elephant seal. Not a care in the world, except great white sharks, of course. And another one coming up. So he's just chilling. I wonder if that other one is still in the lagoon. Look at him just, just sleeping. A big animal. Okay, this is weird. It's like the parking lot's right there. There's a cone and a branch, more driftwood, and there's another seal just hanging out. And they blend in so well. Just chilling. So this sign talks about the dairy and beef ranching. Has been a part of Point Reyes since the 1830s. And they are still here today, some of the original farms California dairy ranches and agriculture Canaveral County with the Spanish missions I'm gonna film this sign about the Nova Albion um, it's too long to read the whole time but if you want to read it just pause the video and then read it it's pretty interesting actually check out a little bug crawling on my arm The lucky ladybug. It's gonna fly away. There it goes. Well, I finally caught this guy. He came up for air. Nothing that big. <laughs> Bless you. Pretty wild, huh? Just hanging out in this little lagoon between the ocean. Hey, everyone. What did you think of that? That was pretty deep. There's another uh, vulture. Um, you know, the elephant seals, the thousands of sand dollars all over the beach, a dead crab shell. There's a lot of interesting things to look at um, here at Drake's Beach and the Point Reyes National Seashore where Sally sells seashells. Anyway, thanks for coming along with me today on my journey, and I will see you guys next time. All right.